The secret video has finally been found. Actually, it was found about two weeks ago, but I've been on vacation, so uh, we're gonna take care of this now. <laughs> So about nine months ago, I came out and announced a challenge for the internet, that I've hidden a secret video somewhere on YouTube on some brand new channel with zero subscribers. I mostly just wanted to see if people could find a brand new video on a brand new channel without knowing the title or anything about the video, really. And it's been a pretty interesting experiment for this whole time. So I'm just gonna go through and explain just everything that happened during this contest, as well as show you exactly how well it's hidden right now and how to find it. And then at the end of this video, I'll show an interview that I had with the winners of the contest. Okay, so here we have the announcement video. First person to find the secret video gets $1,000. Uh, and then I show a short preview of that video uh, right here. So it just says, I, ne I need somebody to come find me. I don't know where I am. And it's just a video of me in the basement of the place that I was living in at the time. So this was the clip that everyone was trying to find. Now, the very first day I, that I uploaded this contest, it was kind of just nuts. So I'm sure a lot of you saw that there were a few decoy videos. So some of you may have stumbled upon the video called Not A Secret Video, which Could it says, actually be? Is this the right video? Nope. It's not. So yeah, people who thought they found the video on day one got a little bit disappointed because uh, I, I gave them a really obvious thumbnail, made it look like this was the right one and people clicked on this, and it was a disappointment. But then, there was something in the description. If you scroll down, there's a link to another video. You're getting a lot closer now. And I gave you another decoy. Now, something interesting I thought of, like, when you tell people that there's a secret video and people are really looking for it, just look at the comparison and views in these videos. So, 2,300 people found this video and 1,500 of those clicked on the link to the next one. I mean, this video is unlisted, but still 1,500 people found it. So you can't tell me that this challenge is impossible because a video is unlisted, because obviously hiding links is uh, not really a great way of really hiding something. So I'm really glad that I didn't just hide the real secret video in this link. Uh, but then you have another decoy channel just called Secret Video. And I mean, a lot of these videos were just like, me walking around in the basement. Just general video that makes it look like it's similar to the secret video. So people watch through the whole thing, but then realize that the part they're looking for is not actually in the video. I for I forgot about a lot of this. I didn't, I forgot that I had like, uh, just waved to the camera. But it's like, nope, this is not the right video either. And then again with this, this other decoy. So 1400 people found this video and then 900 people click the link to the next one. And it's all just giving people the run around. It's all just, uh, I wanted to see how much easier it would be to find if you could see the thumbnail. So apparently if you know the title and you know what the thumbnail is, even if the video has no views, uh, you're gonna be able to find it, which I'm kind of amazed that so many of you guys found these videos because I, I even have a hard time finding them if I search for secret video. Like if you search secret video, you're never gonna find this kind of thing. You gotta scroll for hours just to find it, I'm pretty sure. So now let's talk about where the contest went after this, because like, I was actually having a heart attack on the first day because I was like, oh man, like people have already found the decoys within like 10 minutes. I was just like, oh crap, this thing is all gonna be, just go to waste, it's all gonna be over immediately. But the contest kept going. So the real secret channel was still untouched through all of this. So then next we had the so one the clue, the first extra clue to add to it. And this was me just basically saying that the video you're looking for is over 10 minutes. Uh, not a whole lot of useful information, but you know, it's, it was a little more to go off of. And then in the part three, I announced that the video was uploaded on August 30th. And so you could search for it in the past month. Uh, again, just very minor information. Uh, I think this was also the one where I was like flashing images on the screen, but I'll get to that soon. So then in the part four, part four is where I just like showed three random images. And uh, I eventually announced that these were thumbnails of videos on the secret channel. But when I did this, this is also when I changed the contest a little bit because I was starting to think that nobody was ever going to just stumble upon the video at this point. It was going to be impossible for the contest to ever end. So I changed it up a little bit to where I will help you find the secret channel, 
But then you've got to go down like rabbit holes and find the links to actually find the secret video, which we will go over pretty soon. So I don't know how some of you guys actually found the channel from just these three pictures. Like there were about, I think seven or eight people on the day that this video was uploaded, seven or eight people found the secret channel just from these images. Part of this was like me seeing how capable people are at finding videos. And I was like amazed that people actually found the channel just yeah, from the most basic information. So then eventually I came out and announced that the channel, uh, I think it was in like December, it was like a few months later where I came out and was just like, all right, here's the last bit of information I'll give you. The channel name is just called Bungo. And you won't really be able to find it super easy by just searching Bungo, but right now it might be a little bit easier. Uh, so at the very end of part four, I said, uh, good luck, I'm gonna go take a walk now. So if you search Bungo Walk, I think you gotta search Walk 1, but search Bungo Walk 1, here's the channel, Bungo, and now we're just gonna, and now I'm just gonna take you down the rabbit hole of how you find the secret video. The contest is already over now, I've already found the winner, I'm gonna be sending him the money here shortly, but let me just show you how you find this secret video. So, a bunch of people actually found this Bungo channel over time. Uh, there's a few basic videos with nothing really important, just me walking around. But like I said, the video you're looking for is over 10 minutes long. So here we have this one. So down here at the very end of the video, I mean, it was just very low quality, low rendered videos. So you've got two end screens that link you to the other two videos on the channel. And holy cow, I forgot how bad this video really looks. I uh, really compressed the heck out of it. But then, as you're five seconds away, another video pops up. So you click on this one. And now you are met with a video of literally just the camera sitting in one spot for 11 minutes. There's nothing about the video that really matters, but you're still on the Bungo channel. So you find this unlisted video. And in the description, there are something like 13 links right here. Now this is where it kind of just turns into a virtual maze where you've got to like be clicking through links, trying to find where you're going. But let me just go through and click exactly what will take you directly there. So first from this one, the ninth description to the next. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So from this video, so from fake clips to, so technically you could have just gone to this video and already been on like the third or fourth step. Um, then there's a few links that I would just have in like all of my videos on this channel and I just would swap them out. So camera, mic use, but instead of taking you to a store page, it links you to another video which you could have just started at. Just another old video from Imagine If the Internet Was Real. Now, what do you do from here? Oh, um, there were a lot of places you could have been derailed. There are a lot of videos. Now, there's nothing in the end screens that will help you. Over here, there's another video called Multi Brand Blue. <laughs> just another pointless video, but it takes you to another secret video on the Bungo channel. So from here, you've got three links in the description. Uh, I think I literally just pulled three random videos from Recommended. I think they're like Linus Tech Tips videos right here. Uh, and then you've got like five videos in this Recommended. Uh, then you've got a bunch of videos in the end screens. So it's just like, I'm just giving you the runaround. Like if you've made it this far, you feel like you're making progress, but I'm still just throwing as many different paths just to throw you off. So from here, uh, I think you take it to this video which is just my old channel, Hakuna Matata. It's just like an old channel that I, it was the channel that I used to view YouTube for like the first eight years before I actually started any channels to upload. And then from Hakuna Matata, it's just uh, uploading, <laughs> again, another bunch of different videos linked. Uh, then we take that link Welcome to this scary stories video. I mean, it's just a long rabbit hole. And again, you could have started you could have started by just finding this one video. This video is public. And then from here, I think it's in the info cards again. Then you take it to this video, which is also unlisted. Um, this was just another story video. So if you just started on that scary video and then clicked to this unlisted video, you're already almost done. So from this unlisted story video, this is like the final step. And this is probably the hardest part of this whole challenge. So what you gotta do is if you are on this video, you've gotta go view page source. Um, if you have YouTube extensions, that works too. 
but you want to search for tags. So once you find the list of tags in this video and you look through all of them, the last tag that is added to this video is this series of characters right here. Now what could that be? Now if you copy that and then you type into one of the YouTube videos URL, so just copy that into it, and now you found a video called Sand. Sand uploaded August 30th on the Bungo channel. It's another 10 minute video. It's wandering around my old house that I was living in during this. Wandering around the basement. But then, right here... Uh, I don't know where I am. I need somebody to come find me. And if you are the first person to find me, then you know what to do. This is the video. So there you have it. This is the secret video called Sand on the Bungo channel. Uh, I mentioned before that I don't I don't actually have access to the Bungo channel anymore. I created a new account just using like some new phone number, some like Google Voice number, and then I lost access to the Google Voice number and I can't recover the password for it. So I don't know, I can't access the channels anymore. Doesn't matter. So from five months ago, it says, why hello there? What's taking them so long? And then Golden Lion 5648 says, I found it two weeks ago. That was on May 23rd. So it was about eight and a half months that it took for this thing to be solved. Uh, about 259 days, I think. <clears throat> now, Golden Lion wasn't alone. He was in a group, a Discord group with a few others. And uh, I recently just had a call with them asking them, you know, like how it was trying to find it. And they uh, spent the last five or six months just <laughs> looking through those links, just trying to find it. I know most people lost interest probably within the first week of the contest. But there you have it. That is how the secret video was eventually hidden. Uh, it was a weird experiment. I, it did kind of change over time, but it was always possible to be found, and obviously it was solved. So it was a pretty weird contest, to say the least. And uh, the wash challenge is still going on. But uh, the guys who found this one are like halfway done to finding the the wash challenge too. It didn't quite go how I expected, but uh, I mean, that's okay. It was still kind of fun. But yeah, I guess I'll probably link this secret video in the comments because I'm sure some of you have been wanting to watch this for so long. I know it's a, it's a really exciting video of me just wandering around with no dialogue. Now I'll just play parts of the interview that I had with the winners and I'll be sending them the money. All right, so the Naya challenge is finally done. Well, I guess it was done two weeks ago, but I've been on vacation for the last well, for yeah, I was planning the vacation for a week, and then I was gone the whole week. So, uh, yeah, now we can wrap this thing up. So, uh, how long have you guys been working on it? Were you around since the day I announced it? Oh, so I joined a little later. Steph and Sigma were in it from the beginning, I believe. Yeah, we, we were uh, part of the first to join the Discord. Uh, Steph made the Discord. I was, I think, I was the first to join the Discord. Uh, we were on the chance from the beginning, uh, but I've seen uh, the Discord link to like. Yeah, they originally found the secret channel around when you announced the contest, but I didn't find it until you made the update video back in December. Oh, right. Yeah, so uh, we started with the first announcement video where I was just like, all right, go find it. And I don't think anyone really found the... Um, the real secret video channel uh, until like the third or fourth hint. So, but, um, so on the very first day I announced it, you know, there were the decoy videos, there was the not a secret video, and then there was another <laughs> uh, secret channel too. But uh, yeah, they were all fakes, but a lot of people found those. How fast did you guys find those ones? First day, first day we found the, the two secret channels, the two decoy ones. Yeah, I think. Everyone found them. Um, I didn't find them myself, but I saw the comments of the video had found the decoy channels. I, I think then, every, everyone with the, with the uh, YouTube recommendation got them like really quickly. Yeah, okay. I was amazed that uh, a lot of people happened to find that like right away. I'm wondering after, a fir after the first few people found it, it probably started becoming easier to find through search. Yeah. <laughs> 
But then, but then, yeah, like I was saying, um, I figured that it was going to be impossible for the contest to ever end with me just leaving it as a, a video public with no way to find it. So that's why I changed it a little bit to be, you know, a little bit more hidden. So you had to go digging through rabbit holes. So uh, tell me about the process of you guys um, actually finding it now. So uh, after you had revealed the secret channel, um, that's when I joined it this discord and originally like they had already found it like two months prior to that and they hadn't found the secret link within the end of the video and so at first like i had found it but so i was a little hesitant to tell them about it but um eventually they found it and so that's when we started working together from there that daughter's link yeah huh. it was hidden at the end of one of the videos on the four <laughs> bungo channel yeah, <clears throat> yeah I, I remember we spent so much time on, on searching the the b channel well like we, we even had an email an email to custom email for the B. this was like on the day that um we had found the bungo channel so i think you joined and either you showed that the bungo channel or we had also found it as you had joined, and then we were just like over analyzing early parts of the video, and you just like watched the whole video. Yeah, because then, the link was only the last second of it or something. Yeah, and then after that, I think Daughters was the one that had 13 links in the description. Mm -hmm. And so I had mapped, I mapped each of them out, and I noticed number, number six was like a completely different section of the channel time wise so i looked in it and i saw the link and then i found the next bit right um, yeah so that um uh, how did you originally find the bungo channel because like even when i try and search for bungo and like look through channels i can't even find that yeah i don't even know i when i, uh, I first think... found out that it was called bungo i tried searching it and i couldn't find it myself yeah uh we, we couldn't find it like with the name and i think it's you that that found it uh, with the world keyword, uh, like using the screenshot that was item and the videos, uh, the one frame screenshot we, we have extract of the video, and like we've just searched for world like that was around the the the, the picture uh, content, and uh, I think it's Steph that found it like it was world. Yeah, um, um, I believe someone also linked it in the channel. Wait. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I found the Bungo channel originally. No, Someone else it's found it. Yeah, it's yeah. Monolith, Monolith from the the channel history. I can see it's Monolith. Uh, that's first from the link. So it may be in the found it. Right. So then uh, you follow a bunch of links. There's a bunch of links to a bunch of different videos. It's kind of just a big maze linking to a whole bunch of different videos from all my different channels. Um, and then you get to the one where it takes you to that unlisted video. And then the URL is in the tags of that. How, like, yeah. how long? That's what sent us. Yeah. yeah. How long so, after you found that unlisted video did you figure out the final step? So we found that unlisted video like back early January. I just like sent it and I was like, oh, hey, here's an unlisted video. But um, we didn't look at the tags. It wasn't until I think shortly after that we started using the vidIQ. Chrome no, we extension. had vidIQ well, when we found it. We just yeah. hadn't had that tags open because we didn't think it would be in the tags. Yeah, or if I did have that open, I just like didn't realize it was a YouTube URL. And, and the funniest part is like we, we were searching for the what the what challenge. So yeah, we were searching for wash, and then that's when we like, oh hey, maybe some of those things we already looked at might have this as well. Yeah, yeah so golden found. Uh, number five in the tags and um, we were like we found another wash crew finally and then we also realized that it would be in the tags and then before I even could check any of the other videos Golden found that thing. Yeah that was a that was a bit of a crazy way to finish off the challenge so that one video that has like the 13 links in the description uh, it, scale, it doesn't have like a few hundred views right now um, I feel like quite a few people have stumbled upon that by now, so... I yeah. must have watched every video linked 
at least like five times. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. there was Same. one time, like maybe one or two months ago, where I went to, I think. Yeah, Darty's video of 200 views. Blue, uh, blue multi plan boo. I basically just clicked every link and then every link that was on those videos and every link on those videos. And I just did it until I ran out of links, but I didn't have the um, tags open. So I didn't find anything. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of ways you can hide links on videos because you can put them in the descriptions, you can put them in end screens or in the info cards or even hide it within the comments of the video. So I was just like, hey, I might as well, well just give the runaround. Yeah, and I was like, there's probably going to be some in, in the subtitles, there's probably going to be some in comment replies, because those don't show up with automatic methods easily, and I was trying to think of every single way. Yeah, well, uh, how long did this all take? Wasn't it like uh, eight months? So we started it last September. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. For eight months. And we were stuck on the second to last step for oh, like five of those January. months. So yeah, for so yeah. long like the, the walk video, I remember, like, the, the, the pop-up, like, five seconds after the, uh, before the video ends, we, we took so much time to find it, and, like, we, we were looking at the two first recommendations, and we don't knew where to go until we, we would find, like, a few, de few days later that there is a third video uh, that comes uh, some second after. <laughs> like, we yeah. just didn't look the the walk video to the, to the last step. Second, so we really don't <laughs> like we lose so much time here all right well uh, as for finishing this off i'll probably send the money to golden lion and i'll let you guys um uh split it up how you want um so i'll just have you like send me your paypal information and i'll have it sent probably by tomorrow all right but then yeah. uh yeah maybe uh hold off on finishing the wash challenge i uh i can't be paying out all this all at once <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, thanks for the great challenge. Yeah, hope you had fun with it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Got any hints for the wash one that you're going to give in the Naya video? Uh, a hint for the wash challenge is that it's uh, it's going to be pretty difficult, and I don't <laughs> want you to finish it any sooner than you already will. <laughs>